Hi folks, today I want to show you how easy it is to import new songs from the internet, especially from Hordi.com, uh, a big website where you find many songs even in Chordpro text format and you can work directly with this text in Chordpro Buddy. So first let's start Chordpro Buddy and here we have the new song template and we go to the edit view and delete all the text inside the edit view. Then we start our Safari browser and we go to the website www.hordi.com and here we are and we start the searching for our song i'll take uh let's take blowing in the wind from bob dylan for this example okay here we are and i'll take this version and this is the song okay so how we can use this in chord pro body it's simple go to the right side of this website there is a button called pro click on it and here you find the whole text the original text in quad pro format uh, go to this text window click on it and mark all the text and go to edit copy go to quad pro body edit paste and here we are now we can close the safari view or window and we can work in Chord Pro Buddy okay I resize the window a little bit and what you can see now is on the left side we have the uh, Chord Pro text and on the right side we have the text in formatted view and what I'll first do I will I will edit some things I will delete some things we don't really work we don't really need here I'll delete this one and then let's look after it everything seems to be fine okay that's all it's simple now we can save the song i'll take blowing in the wind as the name and save it on my desktop and the next thing that you can do is you can resize really easily resize titles subtitles you can resize the chorus oh to resize the chorus we first have to mark the chorus as chorus so go to the chorus delete all the leading white spaces we don't need them go on the begin of the chorus right mouse click and then insert chorus start go to the end of the chorus right mouse click insert chorus end okay what you can see on the right side is that the chorus now is separated from the lyrics and you can resize the chorus separately and if you want you can in, uh, uh, increase the chorus indentation or decrease with this slider very easily if you want to resize lyrics and chorus once uh, uh, or with one uh, slider then you can close this lock button and now you can resize the whole text once and you also can uh, connect the sizes from the chords and the lyrics and the chorus and now you can resize all the text with one
slider move. It's, it's really easy. And if you want to print out the text, then simply click on this button on the right side. And then you can click on fit to page height. And now we get the whole text on one page. And if you want to save this as a PDF file, then click on the left side on this button and choose save as PDF. And we can save this as PDF blowing in the wind. And we are ready. We can close this, save the file and now, if we will reopen it, we simply go to open recent, open blowing in the wind, and here you are. And I will show you also the PDF that we created here. It is. This is the PDF file that we created. Okay. This was the introduction into importing new lyrics and chords from the internet. Thank you and bye.